What's up y'all, Jabbar, this is Deuce of Farms, and right next to me I got the Grow Abbey box. If you aren't familiar with it, it's pretty much like an automatic grow system, like a DWC uh, grow system. It's got everything all in one. It's like, you got your lights on it, it's like your tent lights, your actual bucket, everything kind of combined into one, and it's all automatic control through your phone. I've seen other videos, so it's pretty cool, fairly expensive, but I decided to reach out to Grow Abbey the team and get one to showcase you guys through on my channel because I've seen a few people, they have uh, they got the box, they kind of show like, hey, this is what it's at in bed, just what it's at in flower, but I haven't really seen any seed to harvest videos with it, so what I want to do is I want to bring like the grow vlog to it, I want to do that throughout the grow, but I also want to do at the end, have the whole summary of it, the seed all the way up into harvest, an entire grow box so you guys can see and get an actual feel for how it goes. I haven't really seen anybody like showcase the entire process because I don't know if there's actually any problems because looking at it, I'm looking at it like, ah, I don't know, there might be some problems. So, you know, I, I don't really know because I haven't seen a full grow of it. So I want to get one done for myself to showcase you guys um, right now. Other than this, we're in a new setup, as you can see, got a lot of stuff going on. Got the pool table behind me. Got another automatic system we're gonna go. My first irrigation system that I'm setting up, trying to automate it. Um, be honest, it's been a lot of work cutting and uh, doing a lot of stuff with the line over there, but we got that coming. Got the grow tables, they're on the way here. Getting out of the tents for flowers, so it's got a lot of stuff that's gonna be coming soon, but for right now, I just wanna go ahead and get this shit set up for you. I'm gonna be growing for clones, so you guys are gonna see the entire process of this, all the way from clone to harvest. So without further ado, let's go ahead and open it. All right, so we just got it. One thing about it, this thing did not come with a power cord, but I did have something that could fit it. Um, I don't know if they don't come with it in general or this one just happens to not have it in there, but luckily I had another one somewhere that could fit it. It's pretty much just like an extension cord that can plug in. You just need the female end to plug into the middle end. But we're gonna go ahead and get it started. And turn it on. Go ahead and show that right there so you see. The Abbey logo. You just twist it, unlock it, and Voila. boom. Just like that. Now watch the power cord be inside of it. Matter of fact, it is. It is. <laughs> I swear it's probably in one of those boxes. Which, how would we have gotten in the box? Maybe if you just hit the switcher to just open, right? But you can see, that's pretty cool. We got there. It tells you the degrees. You got It's 57 degrees in here right now. It's pretty cold. All right, so my bad, I take that back. The power cord was actually inside of it, which I'm assuming if I looked through the directions, it would have told me how to open it without power, and without the automation, I'm pretty sure. Probably just had to pop a button somewhere, I didn't know that. But safe to say we do got the power cord, so don't have to worry about that. Also, we gotta put the legs on. So I'm gonna go ahead and get that all set up. It's got a replacement pieces for like the, the air stone, which is more of like a net uh, surrounded by the uh, cube. So. That's a cool way to see an airstone like that. That's what I'm pretty much assuming it to be. Oh, no, my bad, my bad. That's a filter of some sort, and then this would be the airstone. Show them right there. Comes with scissors. Actually, that's a pretty cool kit. It comes with a lot of stuff. This right here will probably just be to tie down some cords or something on the inside. What else we got? But yeah, that's pretty much it. I'm gonna go ahead and get everything fully set up and show you guys. So pretty much without power, you just come in right here. And then there's a little lever in there. You just flick that and then boom, you get the door open. All right, so now I'm gonna go ahead and pour my water in, which I'm just using tap water. I know it says like RO or pure water. That's like recommended. Well, I'm sorry. We just don't have that luxury over here. So we're going with the pure tap water straight out of the faucet. All right, and here's a little look at the grow box. They come with like the three month subscription of the nutrients, which is pretty much like Tide Pods in a way. You just pop them in there and go it's got our carbon filter fans and then this right here is going to be our little holder which if you were growing from seed and stuff it comes with the rock wool but we already got cubes and whatnot so we're just going to drop our cube in here since we are growing from clone but i'm going to go ahead and get this set up real quick and then you guys will see it after it's all set up all right and now we're all set up we got our water in there we got the air stones are in there it's also a filter or whatever the air stones the pump is all in there we got our nutrients which is just going to drop in there as soon as we hit the green light and then boom, we got our lights with carbon filter fans up there. And that's just the dial as a temperature and all that stuff. But that's pretty much it. I just wanted to show you guys that. Stay tuned for this because if you've been watching my channel, you know I like DWC. And the fact that I can grow uh, automatic, I mean, that's pretty neat to me. So I can't wait to like really grow this and just do it on the side for fun. Like, of course, we can't really get too big of plants. You kind of got to train them down, which for the plants I'm going to be growing, I'm going with the clone. I would love to do the Mac Nana or the Stomp Bears that you guys just seen the Seed to Harvest. If you didn't see it, make sure you go check it out. It is age restricted, so 
you probably didn't see it but make sure you go check that out i would love to grow in those clones in but i got those over there and the only clones i had readily available readily ready available were the purple sunset so that's actually what's going to get grown in here so make sure you guys stay tuned i'm just going to show you guys throughout the entire journey so appreciate you guys until next time peace